Hello there internet, my name is White Dragons, and this is going to be a quick video. So quick that it's probably not going to be a w wanting of your time. But, what we're here to do today is we're here to discuss on our new location because... Did this person just follow me? Are you following me? Don't follow me. Move freely, you weirdo. Uh, because we are running out of room for villagers to remain safe. And what I mean by that is, is we are losing villagers by, uh, oh, every once in a while we'll lose a villager to a blood moon attack or something like that. And we need to fix that. We need to fix that fast. Uh, by the way, I am still wearing Gold Star. She's super awesome. Uh, he, this dude, why are you, follow me, dude. Why are you still out here? Get in here. You crazy man. Set home and move freely. He loves me because he said because I saved him. So uh, what we're gonna do is we're actually gonna go and take a look because it's night and I don't have to worry about villagers being roaming about. Um, we're gonna take a look and see what we can do here. So um, just back these guys the hell up off me, off my place. A biz. Ah. Uh. Ah, oh, this force bolt is so awesome. Whee! The knockback is crazy. Look at that knockback. Uh. All right, so we know there's a village directly over there. And the, th the problem with that is, is that I don't want to interfere with any villages that have been created except for the one that's out on the water. Um, and while that would be kind of cool to have one... Wow, the knockback is dead on this guy. While it would be kind of cool to have, say, a village where we could uh, go and explore, it kind of messes us up a little bit as far as, uh, you know, I just, I just don't want to mess with their economy, basically. Uh, plus, including with me there, more monsters, no walls, uh, blood moon, they're dead. So, we need to think of another area, and this landscape is pretty good. I like the... Why are there a so guard out here? It's... This is stupid. <gasps> no! I just watched people die. I'll put him out of his misery. Ugh. Ugh. Get out of there. Ugh. 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 I can only save one. Uh, oh God! Oh, oh, get away! Oh man, you're lucky. I flew by. Come on, dude. I'll fly. We gotta get you out of here. Hold tight. Fuck off. Ah, uh, get out of here. All right, we'll put him in here where he's safe. Excuse me, coming through. Excuse me, coming through. And this is what I meant by having issues where... Did... All right. No, it's not you. Where is he? I could have sworn I saved him. Oh, no. I didn't save him. <laughs> okay. Anyways. So this land structure is pretty nice. Um, it needs a lot of work. But I think we can do something with it. And what I mean by that is, is we can actually look into digging underground and working it that way. Why are these guys... Oh my god! Okay. Chill the hell out. Wow. I don't know what's outdated, don't ask me. Huh, okay. Weird. Alright, so I think this is where we'll we'll start. Uh, the shape of the land is not good. So we may have issues there later on. Um, there is another area, like right in here, possibly. Why are people out here? This is so dumb! Ah. 
Are you still following? I think you're still following. I hope you're still following. If not, you're one dead NPC. Oh, you're alive. There we go. Okay. Uh, set home, because if you don't set their home, they will instantly go back to where they were, apparently. So I'm thinking maybe over here? There's a nice... It's almost flat land. It's pretty good looking. It's it's close to the village, but not real close. Maybe we can start doing tradings or something. The only problem I have with it is, is that it's not... That's not a villager, is it? No. Okay. It's well. This area over here is nice and flat and round. Uh, there's I have problems with it. It does have like a ravine, which is right here. Get out of here. It does have a ravine. This is really nice right here, but it's a small one. So meh. I don't know what the hell was supposed to go here when it loaded, but meh. So. There's that. Hey, hey! I told you to shoot at me. Get out of here. So, uh, that's my three choices that I have. Uh, well, the fourth choice is kind of a hard one to do. The fourth choice is actually to build out in the water. Is that skeleton on fire under the water? Can I actually shoot him? No, I cannot. That's weird. Is building under the water... Um, but the problem with that is, is I don't know if villagers will actually spawn or have babies. This is the best way to say it. What are you doing? Who do you think you are? Get out of here. Are you, you're not human. Nope, you are not. Um, so, uh, I don't know. It's a tough, tough decision. One that's going to take me a little bit of time to figure out and a little bit of time to uh, work on. There's a stupid fog when, when it comes to daytime. Um, so, flatland, somewhat flatland. That has a ravine to it, too. This one has a small ravine. And then the third option is building right where we're at, but building on the water going that way. Um, so, decisions, 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 decisions to make, but I just wanted to give you guys a good, a good uh, recap of what we've been doing. As you see, I didn't do a fly run, flyby, but as you can see, this place is beautiful. These trees, unfortunately, there's some of these trees I can't cut, um, because I don't have the hatchet right now. And that's the other thing is, is I want to go ahead and get an area starting, getting area established. So I can start working on Tinker's Construct stuff. So that is one of my big things I've got to get doing, getting getting going on right now. What the hell are you doing? Getting that damn water. Little shit. So, um, I don't know. It's This is going to be a difficult one to decide. Because like I said, I could build underwater? That's not a real, it's not a super problem for me. But the pro, I can just find a, a suit that gives me water capability. But the problem is, is I don't. Ow! Jerk. Where do you go? Oh, there he is. Like these guys here, they can swim. They can. They they move fast in the water. Jerk. But um, yeah. So that's the options I've got. That's the options I'm gonna use. And uh, like I said, whatever I plan on doing, it'll probably be a little bit off camera. Um probably wherever I'm going to build. I'm going to build a bridge connection from this area to the next. Uh, so that way we always have this area to play around with. So, off camera, this is what's going to happen. I'm going to decide where I'm going to, where basically I'm going to park myself. And then from that point, what we will do is, is we will build a bridge out to the new location and I will hollow out What? Did this dude just throw something at me? Yeah! He's a ninja. Okay, I see. I can't believe that this actually hurts me. That sucks. You stay over there, you bastard. Um, so we'll build a bridge, we'll hollow out the area, and we'll start working on 
getting things organized and done. Now, in the near future, we may have some NPCs that come along that may be able to help us or we may be able to shop by. I did talk to some of the locals over there and I did talk to some of the locals that are way over there. And they did say that there were traveling salesmen that did come by and talked to them every once in a while. And some of the people there, over there, want to come over here and start opening shops. So that means I may have some shops already open uh, when you get back. So we'll find out. But guys, that's pretty much the episode. I want to say thank you for watching all this and more. And as always, guys... I'll catch you on the other side. Bye-bye.